On to the United States now, where Democrat Tulsi Gabbard has officially launched her 2020 presidential campaign in Hawaii. In the opening address, Tulsi Gabbard called for saving the United States from corporate greed and corruption. Gabbard said the principles on which the U.S. Was, was founded are now far off reality. The hatred and divisiveness, she says, have cast a dark shadow over the country. She told the uh, supporters and the crowd she was addressing that uh, she was running against powerful, self-serving politicians and greedy corporations and she has vowed to restore dignity, honor and respect to the presidency. If she wins the White House, she would uh, be the youngest president in American history. A Samoan American, Gabbard was the first Hindu elected to the Congress. Gabbard has consistently opposed U.S. intervention in Syria going as far as to secretly meet with the Syrian president Bashar al-Assad in January 2017, sparking fierce criticism within her own party. She opposes removing Assad from power. She remains popular with some progressives, but will have serious competition on that front with candidates such as Senators Kamala Harris and Elizabeth Warren in the presidential field. Gabbard also was forced to apologize for her past opposition to same-sex marriage, which she now supports. When we raise our right hand and volunteer to serve, we set aside our own interests to serve our country, to fight for all Americans. We serve as one, indivisible, united, unbreakable, united by this bond of love for each other and love for our country. It is this principle of service above self that is at the heart of every soldier, at the heart of every service member. And it is in this spirit that today I announce my candidacy for President of the United States of America. I will bring this soldier's principles to the White House, restoring the values of dignity, honor, and respect to the presidency and above all else, love for our people and love for our country. So I ask you to join me. Join me in putting this, this spirit, this spirit of service above self at the forefront and to stand up against the forces of greed and corruption.